Hey, I'm Dave Hebert. I'm here in the sunset in San Francisco, California, and I'm going to teach you how to bomb hills. I'm from the East Coast originally, but I always wanted to come to San Francisco for the hills. Um, I grew up watching like and idolizing like Dennis Boussinitz, like John Cardio, like fast, like fast paced rippers. So when I got out here, there's hills and I just wanted to learn how to skate them. When I first got out here, the first hill I went down, yeah, I was nervous. Um, I hit a crack, so maybe that's the first thing you want to look for when you're like bombing a hill. Also cars, um, pedestrians, crazy taxi cabs is a big one. Um, yeah, just little things like here and there, pretty much anything chaotic. So when you're bombing a hill, you want to be able to like do backside, frontside power slides. That way you can slow yourself down. I mean, if you're absolutely that uncomfortable, you can put your foot down, but I would not recommend it. Also, when you're bombing a hill, you want to watch out for like four-way stops. Sometimes there is not a stop sign there, so just keep a lookout for cars. That's like one of the biggest things I try to do. If I'm going absolutely way too fast, I will run out of it, but that's only under the craziest circumstances. Funnest thing about bombing hills is just seeing like everything, like then you're going down the hill, like to the right and left side of you. There might be a wall that you can wall ride or a hydrant you can ollie over. A random garbage can on the road you can just ollie over, but that's what makes it fun. It's totally sporadic and yeah, that's why I like bombing hills. So yeah, to everyone watching, I suggest come out to SF, bomb hills. It's super fun. Um, try to go fast, do longer power slides, and yeah, hit everything you can on the way down. And then you want to have your back foot. Oh, the back foot's all the whole the whole thing about this trick. You put your back. Yeah.